I was um, in my flat where I used to live in Bristol, and I had a friend staying, Kim, an Australian woman, and she's a Steiner teacher, and she was saying that one of the questions that Steiner teachers ask is, what are you here to do? And so it was just reflecting on that, okay, what am I here to do? And I was just thinking, one thing I really want to do before I die is write my book. I'd had this idea of writing a book about personal power for years and I'd had various failed attempts where I'd sort of set off to try and write and then I'd ground to a halt and bumped into something. And at that time it was, I'd just put it on the shelf as an idea, but it was hearing myself say the thing that I most want to do before I die is get this book written. Um, I thought, well, you know, hearing myself say that, I thought, well, if that's true, writing it. Why don't I put some time in every week? And so I remember that conversation as something that nudged me into really taking the project seriously. What that makes me want to ask is, she saw in you the sort of person who would be receptive to that kind of provoking question. Maybe, yes, maybe. Hmm. And, I mean, it was also, you know, we were just talking about what it is we do, what's important to us. And I, w I was also really interested in her work. And so um, it, was, it was kind of curiosity about her work drawing out this kind of core question. But it's more like it, it, it's a stance. It's a stance that's based on an idea that we are here to play a role in something, in it, that we are here to play a part in some larger story. And that when we find our part in that larger story, it's very, um, it's very, it's kind of, how's it, very turning to a sense of being at home, a sense of being on course as opposed to being off course, or having found the plot as opposed to having lost the plot. It's not the sort of question most of us get to hear for years on end. And I think that's a shame. I think that's a shame, and I think some people have even given up on the idea that there is um, some purpose to our life. I mean, I've heard friends say, oh, there's no such thing as purpose in life. And, and, and I, th I think that that's, it, it misses something out. And, it, and, and I think of like a good life as very similar to a good story. And for a good story to be something that you want to turn the pages, you need to have a good plot. And I think it's the same in life too, that if you have a good plot, it's like, rather than turning the pages, you want to wake up the next day, you want to see how it's going to go next. But also, you want to play a role in moving the story forward. Brilliant. This is very inspiring. I just wonder though, have you um, told her what impact she had? I've lost touch with her, you know. And about this makes me think... I really want to find her again. So, Kim, if you ever watch this, you know, know that I'm very grateful to you. And also, I, it was over 10 years ago. It was about 10 years ago. And so I want to hunt out my old diaries from that time because um, I, I think I can vaguely remember her email address. So, yeah, no, I'd love to let her know and send her a copy of the book, Find Your Power, um, because she played a key role in helping me write that. Brilliant. And one, okay, this really is my last question. How does it feel to have said all of this? It feels affirming and confirming. It's that thing about, I think we have hidden jewels, you know, that things that we've stumbled along in our lives that have been of really great value. And I think important life-changing conversations are like those. And when we reflect on those, it's like their impact is, it, it, their impact returns. It, it takes you back. There was like one line that you put a, a highlighter pen through. And it's like, then you pick up the old book and you look back at that sentence at a highlighter pen um, through it, sort of marking it out as having special significance. And so what it does is it brings it back in a way that the conversation, it's like an echo of the conversation, so its effects can still be felt.